I got started teaching in IT by accident. I never intended to be on a teacher or anything like that. I never dreamed of it or anything. I got a job here at the district just to do admin work for years. I was assigned a campus, which is Holmes High School. And a lot of kids were asking me to help them build computers. They would come to me and say, hey, Mr. Crow, would you help me teach, build a computer? And I'd say, yeah, I come to my lunch and we'll build computers, fun. So before I know it, I was building computers for about four or five kids. A new principal, she goes, I heard you want to teach kids to build computers. I go, no, I think you should teach kids how to build computers. I don't, I'm not a teacher. She goes, well, I can take care of that. Two weeks before school starts, she had a key, and she goes, here's your key to your room. And I opened the door, and there was nothing in it. It was completely empty. I go, well, where are the chairs? She goes, I don't know. She goes, what about, what about computers? And she goes, I have no idea, but here's your key. You start in two weeks. We talked to the administration. They were going to, they said, oh, your program will never go. High school students are too immature for these type of programs. We tried it, and it was a miserable failure. I said, well, it's going to be so good because I'm going to teach these kids and it's going to, we're going to get them certified. Well, the issues we have with a Title I school is you have to convince them that this is something they can do and that this industry is there for them, that they can actually make a lot of money. Because a lot of them don't think that way. They think that they're going to be stuck on the west side. The thing is, they don't think they're worthy of it. It's really odd. I and mean, you have to convince them that they are and that they are just as smart as anybody else. Before I didn't know much, I would stay quiet. I wouldn't answer the questions. But then as I went on and I started knowing things, I felt empowered, like I knew something I could participate in. The satisfaction of, the, of it was overwhelming for me at first. I, I cried almost every day whenever a kid got certified. It's pretty crazy. I could never get tired of it, watching that face come alive when they, when they pass that test. And it's even cooler when a kid drives up in his Audi and picks me up for lunch and he's making $130,000 a year and he's only 20 years old. I decided to take Mr. Cadetta's class in high school primarily to just learn more about computers. I didn't really think at the time it would take me into IT, but it inevitably did. Holmes High School has an excellent information technology program. They are adequately preparing their students for some of the high demand IT positions that are available here in San Antonio. Not only for Rackspace and Rackspace Open Cloud Academy, but across the city. Tessa has been great. I mean, the organization is fantastic. How Testa made my life easier as instructor is the, is the virtual labs or the lab simulations. And the kids can do it over and over until they get it right. They're doing things that are exactly what they're going to do in the real world. When they get on a router, it's going to feel like that. When they get into Linux, it's going to feel like that. Test out SlabSim, uh, it helped me by giving simulations that would benefit somebody in the, in the IT field who didn't have actual hands-on experience, and that really helped me get a step ahead in the IT field. I didn't have the money to go and buy the gear to go test out routers, go test out switches, so the lab simulators really prepared me for the hands-on experience that I just couldn't get at the time. I've learned so much with Test Out, and I feel that whatever the world throws at me, I'll be ready to take it. After taking all these classes and using LabSim, I realized that they're not as hard as they seem. If you really put your mind to it, you can go far in life. Um, it just gave me that sense of confidence, the edge needed to, to actually make it within this field. The rewards from this job have been way greater than I ever imagined. I just, I just, I can't even begin to describe what it feels like to see a kid come in with absolutely no knowledge and then a few years later they're certified and they're just loving it. It's just so satisfying to see it. And I think it's why I keep doing it. I mean, I, I could be making a lot more money, but the satisfaction would be hard to, to duplicate. And Test Out helps a lot because it's professional. It's not a toy, it's a professional level software.